In this video I'll explain how to create a random matrix using the R programming language. So without too much talk, let's dive into the R code. So in this video I will show you an example and this example is based on the code that is starting at line 2. And in line 2 I'm first setting a random seed to make our example reproducible. And then in the next step, in lines 3 to 6, I'm applying the matrix function. And within the matrix function, I'm using the sample function to create a random sample of the numbers 1 to 100. Then I'm also specifying within the sample function that I want to draw 20 values of this vector from 1 to 100. And I'm specifying the replace argument to be equal to true to tell R that I want to draw a sample with replacement. Then I'm also specifying the end call argument to be equal to four to tell the matrix function that I want to create a matrix with four columns. So if you run lines three to six of the code, you can see at the top right of RStudio that a new matrix object is appearing. And we can print this matrix to the bottom in the RStudio console by running line 7 of the code. And then you can see that we have created a matrix consisting of 5 rows and 4 columns. And this matrix contains random values with a range from 1 to 100. That's all I wanted to explain in this video. In case you want to learn more on this topic, you may check out my homepage statisticsglobe.com because on my homepage I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the content of this video in some more detail. I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video so you can find it there. If you have liked this video or if you have any questions, let me know in the comments section below. I'll try to respond to all comments as soon as I can. Furthermore, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notified about future video releases. I have already published about 500 videos on this channel and I'm releasing new videos on a daily basis. Thanks a lot for watching. See you in the next video.